Guardians, what is up? We are back here again for your feature weapon reset for Banshee 44. Before we get into the video, guys, I want to thank you guys for stopping by watching this video. Please make sure you guys smash that subscribe button if you have not already. And to stay up to date on all things Banshee 44, Destiny 2, because tomorrow, Bungie has alluded to some sandbox changes that will be coming March 5th. So there will be a long list of adjustments to weapons um, in regards to abilities, all that good stuff. So stay on the lookout for uh, me dropping a video talking about all of that once we get the This Week in Destiny tomorrow. So I wanted to give you guys a heads up on that. But yeah, let's get into things today. We got Whispering Slab with Archer's Temple, Swashbuckler, Straw Time Masterwork, Oldie But Goody for the Whispering Slab, a uh, good pickup for the Whispering Slab. We got Cartesian Coordinate with Snapshot Sights, Feeding Frenzy with a Charge Time Masterwork. We got the True Prophecy with Demolition as an open shot, opening shot uh, with a Reload Masterwork. We got the Legal Action 2 with Osmosis and Surplus coming in with a Reload Masterwork. And then last but not least, we got Palmera B coming in with a Explosive Light Ambitious Assassin roll. Um, we got Impact Casing and Hard Launch, good perks here. Uh, reload Masterwork on this um, with Ambitious Assassin. Probably won't need that too much. Um, follow velocity or impact a master will be best here this is a craftable weapon as I, as I was saying for primary b so you can craft it the way you want or if you just need one for the time being feel free to grab this one but and there's supposed to be something going on with precision rocket launchers and i think that was rapid fire i believe i know i remember seeing precision frame so maybe they'll be making some improvements to this this is a good roll so they want to grab it Maybe there's be some changes coming in the new, um, coming into March, so you never know. Uh, but in recap, guys, for today, pickups will be Primera B. Whispering Slab will be your pickups for today, guys. Keep in mind, if you're new to Destiny, returning player or anything like that, uh, you guys have until 6 p.m. Central, 7 Eastern to swing by Banshee 44 and pick these weapons up. If, as well, you are looking to catch up with Destiny, um you can go over to humble bundle i'll put the link in the description guys are looking to catch up on destiny or you're lacking some dlcs this would be a good time to swing by humble bundle you can get pretty much six of the major dlcs to catch up in destiny for like 40 dollars. this is a very very good deal uh one of uh, the one of the members of the community even commented and said this is how it should be Anyway, going forward with when it comes to DLCs for Destiny, I 100% agree with you on that. This should have be how it should be. I feel, I think I've said this even in social media posts, uh, commenting on all other uh, Destiny 2 creators like players coming into the game. Anything past the most recent major one, um, you should be able to pay for Lightfall because it's the most recent one. And then which coin should have every single thing from the previous wrapped into it, bundled into one bundle by itself, where you only have to really look at two SKUs. You're either jumping straight in to the most recent expansion, or you're going to go from the beginning and work your way up to that and then get the other deal. So you shouldn't have to pay, you shouldn't have to pay, you know, for like, 12 different SKUs uh, for Destiny. It makes it very, very confusing for a new player trying to join in and want to play this game. So I feel like it should be really cut down to two SKUs. The most recent expansion, same thing goes for when Final Shape drops. When Final Shape drops, it should be Final Shape and it should be Lightfall. And Lightfall should conclude Witch and Queen, Shadow Keep, Forsaken, all of that stuff should be wrapped into one bundle with one skew and make it that simple for players um 
But with that being said, guys, I thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for stopping by. Uh, shout out to all the new subscribers who have joined the community. Shinobi Shadow Squad is the name of my community on my YouTube channel. I have a thing for ninjas and samurai. So um, we also have memberships going as well. Memberships start at $1.99. You get emotes and all that good stuff that are destiny thing and samurai theme. So if you guys want to join the Shadow Squad uh, by supporting the channel through those means, please feel free to do so. But with all that being said, guys, I thank you guys for watching. Please make sure you guys get a video a thumbs up if you found this video very helpful. And I will catch you, Guardians, on the next one.